Hello, hey up and hey diddly, my name is Steve and once again it's a great big warm welcome from myself to Let's Explore. Right then, as you've seen by the title of this video, the Charmwood Forest Canal, which opened in 1794, does indeed have water back in it once again. No, they've not restored it and there's never going to be a boat down it again, or indeed a great big Shiros walking down it, pulling a, a 70 foot barge. But, we've had that much rain just recently, there's a small section of the old gel, the old canal, near Tamworth Close in Shepshed that's got water in it and I'm going to show you it very shortly because we've had copious unbelievable biblical amounts of rain the last couple of days haven't we but as you can see here it's very sad as well because as many of you know that have been watching my videos for the last three years from the age of 11 up until i was 21 I lived in Shepshed on Anson Road, number six there, opposite the uh, the old Oxley pub, which is now a bloody co-op. Every, everywhere seems to be turned into a co-op, doesn't it? But if you'd have told me when I was a little kid, when I used to come up here with my mates, White Horse Wood, if you'd have told me then that this field opposite the wood would um, one day be a building development, I'd have said, no chance, not, not a chance. That's never gonna happen. People won't have that. People are too fond of this countryside for a start, but we're building here, we're building right over there as well, aren't we, on Tico Lane as well. You know, we're gonna end up going all the way down to the Black Brook, aren't we, if we're not careful. And I think it's actually gonna happen all the way along. Now, when I say Black Brook, we have, we have got developments right next to the Black Brook. I, I mean, down near the Ake next to the railway and the old canal. Uh, I think that that may happen one day, which is, which is very sad. But I suppose you have to remember, you know, people like myself celebrate these old canals and railways, but people probably didn't want those when they were built either. You know, the industrialization of these, these villages like Shepshed and towns and cities, people probably didn't want it. They may have wanted the work, but they didn't want the other stuff that came with it. But um, anyway, let's get on with it and go and see the old girl with some water in it because I've never seen this section of the canal with water in it. Let's go and have a nose there. I'm expecting there to be a lot of water beneath this old bridge. And there is, so it's that kind of, you know, it's got that ready tinge to it, a very mucky colour, and that's purely because yeah, we've had runoff coming down this side. Now, the other side of the hill, there is a brook, of course, but this side, everything's going to find its way down here. And this is why the canal's filling up, as you're going to see. So for many years, I walked and played all around here, and I've never seen this amount of water down here, ever, never. And is it these building developments? I don't know. Or is it just all the rain we've had? I don't know. Let's go through here anyway. Right, let's make us way under the old railway bridge then. And I could go an easy way, to be honest with you. Um, but I just want to show you the ferocity of, you know, what's been happening with this water, because I've just been talking to a chap up the top of there. And he says, I've lived here 35 years. He says, and yes, he says, I have seen a bit of flood water down here. He says, but never this bad. He says, never. Um, I mean, apparently there was some official people from the building company stood just over the other side of here yesterday he said and they looked worried <laughs> because of the color of this water um but it's no good though is it it ain't no good now i don't know if i am going to be able to walk all the way through it because it is getting very deep as you can see but no i've never seen it like this do you know what i ain't going to be able to get through it's deeper than i even thought it were look at this So we're near the top of the old well, isn't we? Um, yeah, I think I'll just walk round. So even though I had my wellies on for once, <laughs> I was defeated. I ain't getting wet feet this morning, but uh, it would have brought us out to here. So, right, so what you haven't seen in this video, where you've just seen me uh, beneath that railway bridge that's flooded, this is the canal now, by the way. I've just been talking to this lovely couple Paul and Rachel Bonham, lovely couple. He watches my videos and we've just been gassing for what felt like about five weeks. My fault as per usual, because once I start, I can't stop. It's like a pack of Pringles, isn't it? Other crisps are available. <laughs> so hello the pair of you, if you're watching, great to meet you, lovely people. Anyway, here we are down by the old Charmer Forest Canal and it does indeed have water in it once again. So at this point in the canal this is where it all started for me i used to ride my bike up and down here all the time and 
you know, I never, I've never seen water in it. I've never seen flood water get into this canal. Now, of course, the concern is, now this water's gone down a little bit. I came down here yesterday for a bit of a nose out. It has dropped a little bit. Maybe, maybe half a foot it's gone down. Um, but of course, you know, if this gets bad again, and it breaches over the side of here, then it's going to be down, it's going to be in all these back gardens, isn't it? And of course, when I were a kid, none of these houses was here. You know, I've just, like I've just been saying to Paul and Rachel, you know, Tamworth Close, which is just over there, we used to come down the jitty at, at Tamworth Close that connects onto the railway path. And, you know, once you got down to this point, down to here, it felt like you was in the middle of nowhere, but it ain't anymore because you've got all these developments. But... Ain't that fantastic to see the old canal? This side, of course, I'm pretty sure was the actual towpath. Um, but of course, you know, the Charmer Forest Railway, that's up that side. Let's just see how far back we can go. Uh, maybe not far. I mean, there's nowhere for this water to go at the minute. I mean, it, it will slowly drain away, but I mean, of course, when the canal opened in 1794, you know, the colour of it wouldn't have <laughs> been that reddy orange colour, of course. Let's get on the towpath. I love this, you know, this nostalgia. I don't know, we're moaning about these building developments. <laughs> and yet, you know, when this were built and the railway, um, no one wanted that either. That would have been seen as a, a major blot on the landscape. But of course, the people that have got all the money, the industrialists, they certainly wanted it. Pay people a pittance to work on it while they take all the cream same it's the same now isn't it this day and age so there you go that's that's looking up towards tamworth close i can't really get much further down here that's going towards Tico lane bridge of course down there right well unfortunately that concludes today's video i hope you've enjoyed it only a little video today but i've never experienced the charmed forest canal like this with water in it you know, we moved to Shepshed when I was 11 years old and I moved out of Shepshed when I was 21. So I spent many happy years as a kid, as a teenager, you know, up and down here on my bike. And then when I found out that it was actually a canal when I was about 15, you know, exploring it and what have you, as, you know, as well as the adjoining railway next to it as well. But just to see it like this, yes, it's horrible, orangey, red, muddy water from the adjacent building site but it, it has brought it back to life slightly to be honest with you um you know if we get any more flood water of course and it breaches and goes into these back gardens they'll they'll, uh, they'll be all hell to pay won't they but um yeah fantastic to see you can just imagine the the shy rosses walking up and down this canal uh, towpath just behind me here having my right shoulder here pulling you know 70 foot long barges down here full of coal and actually uh, lime as well from barra hill at uh, Osgothorpe. Anyway, I'll see you again. Thanks for watching this. Not very long, but you've got something. I thought it was interesting anyway. Bye.